Scene headings aren't the only line type in Writer Duet that can have numbers. We can actually activate numbering on any line type within the app. This can be super useful if you want to, for example, number how many transition lines you've used for yourself, if you want to check how many notes you've left, uh, or any other reason you can think of for numbering lines. The way we activate this is very similar to the way we turn them on for scenes. We're just going to go to the Customize Menu option, and if you don't see this menu along the top of your screen, you're likely in our simplified layout and just need to click the three line icon in the upper left hand corner and you should see all of these same menu options. So once you've located these menu options, go ahead and click customize and go down to page. Now if we scroll down to numbering, we can see that scene is currently selected and we have the scene numbering turned on. However, if we want to check how many transition lines we've used, for example, we can simply change the dropdown to transition and activate number there as well. We can still switch back to scene and it will still be turned on. Or we can even turn it off if we want our transition lines to be the only thing numbered. So if we exit out of here, we can see our transition line has the same exact numbering and if we'd like, we can go right back here and customize the numbers a little bit to make them stand out from our scene numbers. For example, maybe we only want these to show on the right, right next to where the transition would appear. So we'll uncheck show numbers on left. And now we just have a simple number showing which number of transition line this is. And just as with scene headings, we create a transition line by typing cut to any two colon statement or pressing tab twice, we'll see that it automatically gains a number.